shocked and hurt and saddened and angry and scared. David Phones says the news of the shooting at Club Q in Colorado Springs, the only LGBTQ club in that city, triggered a wave of emotions. Because it hits so close to home. Phones is the owner of Scandals, an LGBTQ plus bar on Southwest Harvey Milk Street in downtown Portland. They lost their safe place and they maybe never will find that again, you know, and we've tried really hard to be that safe place and you realize how fragile that can be. It's terribly sad um, and really heartbreaking, um, but unfortunately it wasn't necessarily a huge shock or surprise. Blair Stenvik is with Basic Rights Oregon, a statewide advocacy organization. Even here in Oregon, we're seeing an increase in anti-LGBTQ plus rhetoric. People have to understand that when they um, increase that violent rhetoric, they're potentially inciting violent acts. Reports to Oregon's bias crime hotline increased by over 50% in 2021 alone. And even if the physical spaces where we gather change or get targeted, our community is is even stronger than those physical spaces. Advocates say places like Club Q are important to the LGBTQ plus community. They know that they'll be uh, affirmed or they'll be addressed with the right name and pronouns and respected for that identity. Um, it can be really valuable. I think what places like Scandals bring to the community is a place where you get to be normal, not accepted, but we're normal here. Celebrate the people you love, celebrate the family you have, celebrate love over hate. Basic Rights Oregon has resources on its website, basicrights.org, for anyone experiencing mental health difficulties as a result of this news. Brittany? 